Hey guys, what's up, Rift Tech? Today I just want to revisit Good Lock because Samsung has actually been updating it at least twice a month, which is amazing. So as you guys can see, you have more settings in the Good Lock app. So in lock screen, everything is the same, but it's the other in advance where they've really added a lot of features. So you have the order you want your quick toggles to be. They actually had added that in the second update, so I've been using it, but I haven't showed it off on video, so. There you guys go. <laughs> Alright, so they have an S Finder shortcut as well as a color notification card. So the card changes to the color that you have chosen, but with black, you can't really see all of the text. S Finder, I actually don't see. I just see all and I see keep. So I'm not sure I'm going to be using that. So let me just turn both of those off. Actually, I should leave that on. I actually like the little dim effect and the blur effect that it gives. They also added multi-window badge to the notification bar. So let me turn that on and just show you guys. Because that email I have, you see that little icon. You can make it into a floating or multi-window. But it completely crashes on the Note 4. I had to pull my battery. I tried it three times. Nothing would work. Silent with volume down key, I couldn't get to work either. Next, backup and restore. You can back up how you have your colors and all your settings and restore it on a different Samsung phone, I assume. This one is great. You can actually send Samsung feedback if you have a crash. So it gives them their model number, good lock number, and it sends it right through them. So that's a good look. Good job, Samsung. Now let me show you guys how you can change the colors. No, no it's not here. I actually forget sometimes. Okay, here's where it is. So routine, I just hit no. I don't want the location spying crap. So right here, it lets you choose your clock. And then here's where you choose your colors. You have so many options. So now at the bottom, you guys see, you can actually choose your main color. So you can flip those and see now white is the main color. So you can flip those around and really basically you can make any color that you want. It's actually insane the amount of different options that you have now so now I have red with like greenish type of text so let me show you guys so like I got that maroon with that green right there as you guys can see so it's cool so let me just go through the amount of options you have look at that that is insane <laughs> so I'm really happy that they're updating this app So let me just show you guys now, it's all dark again. Another thing that I really love about Good Luck. So another thing is as you guys can see, Samsung has been updating this twice a month. So I was using the second one. So the last update was five days, just five days ago. So that's the one I'm using currently. Link is in the description if you want the updated version. Another amazing feature I love about Good Luck is on the lock screen you can double tap your notification to open it that's probably one of my most used features because like, I have it on my desk at work I'll just double tap it and I'll go into the notifications so I just want to thank you guys for watching don't forget to subscribe if you haven't yet all right so yeah I just wanted to really quickly go over good luck one more time let you guys know it has been updated not sure if the fingerprint works yet you guys try it. Let me know if it does in the comments. I'll see you guys next time. All about that tech life. Take care. Bye-bye.